the first thing we want to do when using logic for sound analysis is to change the display over to time. So I can do that by clicking here and selecting time. But then we'll notice that it goes into hours, minutes, seconds, and then um, frames. And we don't want frames, we want milliseconds because we want to be able to figure out exactly how long a sound is. So to change that, we need to go into the preferences and select display. And then within that, uh, display time as, we want to select that. So it's the hours, minutes, seconds, and milliseconds. And there we go, it's changed at the top there. That will be really useful later on.